<laughs> Texas, one of the most unique states in the country. Home to wide open ranch land, cowboys, and some of the fastest growing urban communities in the lower 48. Come along as we explore some of the Lone Star State's best restaurants, breweries, and cities, and experience Texas through the eyes of the people that live here. This is Exploring Texas. Welcome to Frisco, Texas. If you're considering moving anywhere in Texas, particularly somewhere in the Dallas-Fort Worth Metroplex, you absolutely have to consider Frisco, Texas. I'm currently standing at the Cowboys headquarters, which will also be very, very near to the PGA headquarters. One thing about Frisco in particular is it's technically considered a suburb of Dallas or Fort Worth, but honestly, that's kind of offensive. Frisco itself is a raging city. It has so much of its own culture, it has so much of its own entertainment and a life of its own that making it a suburb of another city is really, really, honestly, shooting it low. And today, we're gonna to show you around Frisco, Texas so that you can familiarize yourself with everything that Frisco has to offer for you and your family. So the Ford Center isn't all about the Dallas Cowboys. The Ford Center is actually a center that's known to host a lot of different community events from high school games, concerts, and so much more. A little to the left, we have the Omni Hotel, the Renaissance Hotel. So when you have those guests visiting that you don't necessarily want to have inside your home, you absolutely have a phenomenal place to have them. Across the Ford Center and now behind me, we have tons and tons of restaurants and different options for you to dine at. Everything from City Works to Cane Rosso. There's even a Lucchese store that actually has exclusive merchandise just for the Cowboys. Regardless, you still should check out Lucchese's if you're looking for a sweet pair of Texas boots. One place in particular that I absolutely love, which is actually our first visit for today, is Ascension Coffee Shop. As you drive around or you walk around the star, you're gonna see a lot of memorabilia that plays homage to previous players and current players of the Dallas Cowboys. But one thing about the Dallas Star in particular is that it's not just about the players, it's about the fans. So as you make your way around, you're actually gonna see a statue that's in the middle of a roundabout. And the way the pavers are set up are made that as you drive around, it mimics the sound of a cheering crowd. So this whole environment is carefully crafted to make sure that as a participant, you feel immersed in the culture of what it is to be a true Dallas Cowboys fan. If you love baseball and you love swimming, you're gonna love this. The Frisco Rough Riders, a AAA baseball team that is home here in Frisco, Texas, actually has a lazy river in the outfield of the baseball field itself. You can be lounging around while enjoying a awesome game played by the local Frisco Rough Riders. So we started off with all the cool new stuff. We started at the Dallas Star, I showed you guys the Frisco Rough Riders, but I wanted to bring you guys downtown Frisco. All within this downtown, you have plenty of restaurants and bars and coffee shops to live life. You honestly could never have to leave this general area if you didn't want to. If you're in the area and you're like, what am I gonna eat? I definitely recommend you check out Babe's Chicken. But I do want to walk into one of my favorite bars. It's very low key. It's a really cool place just to hang out with friends. We're going to go to the Derby Shire. And right after that, I want to show you guys one of the coolest things that's downtown. Awesome. Thank you. No Appreciate you. Would you like to put in the No, I'm good. Thanks. The city is growing considerably. In 2020, the population was just a little over 200,000. So in a short period of time, we've seen a huge amount of people move to the area. The average median income in the area is a little over 180,000, and the average age of someone in the area is about 37.8. So it's a relatively young population, and it's pretty much a lot of working professionals. There's tons of companies that are headquartered or have large offices here, from JP Morgan to Toyota. Again, we talked about the, the Dallas Cowboys headquarters and the PGA. So there's a lot of investment in the area or the surrounding cities. So as soon as I finish this beer, I'm gonna take you guys to take a look at what has to be one of the coolest things that's downtown Frisco. It's the Toyota Stadium, which is the home of FC Dallas. 
So if you're into soccer, again, the sports just continue. So we started with the Dallas Cowboys. I showed you guys a little bit of baseball, but next is soccer. Another really cool fact about the Toyota Stadium itself is the fact that it's also home to the National Soccer League. So if you're someone who loves the history of soccer, this is gonna be an awesome place for you to visit. A little bit of a fun fact, I don't know if it's about the stadium, but about me, but when I was a little bit younger, I really wanted to see a country concert and they were hosting it inside of the FC Dallas Stadium. So I decided to volunteer for about six hours to be able to get free admission into this concert. Turns out the concert was like $20, but honestly, it was extremely fun. I got to explore the entire stadium. So Frisco, as you probably have seen by now, is a city that encompasses a lot of tradition, but yet modern aspects. It's something of a new world and an old world. And there just seems to be something for everybody. And what that usually means is that everyone wants to live here. And unfortunately, that comes at a cost. Currently, the average home in Frisco is roughly $672,000, which is a little bit on the high side for the entire DFW Metroplex. Regardless, there are beautiful homes here in the Metroplex, or here in Frisco, that you can purchase for a little bit less and several millions more. In fact, I wanna show you guys Fields. Fields is a new construction community here in Frisco, Texas, that is going to be incorporated into the PGA golf course. It's gonna have tons of amenities, trails, lakes, whatever your heart desires, I promise you this master plan community is gonna have it. So without further ado, let's go to the fields. We are now in Fields, the community in Frisco, Texas that I mentioned to you guys that is connected to the PGA and it's gonna be an awesome master plan community with tons and tons of amenities. They currently have, I think, a little over 10 builders. Everything from your custom home to your semi-custom to your fully custom home, and they're building on lots on all shapes and sizes. I really hope that you enjoyed looking at these beautiful homes just as much as I did. Fields is a community that offers so many amenities, everything again from pools, trails, you know, parks, everything your heart could possibly desire. And that is honestly the best representation of the city of Frisco. I hope that you love Frisco just as much as I do, and I hope that you consider it as your future home. So if you or anyone you know is looking to move to the DFW area, maybe Frisco in particular, I wanna connect with you. So click on the link below, connect with me, or simply subscribe to learn more about Texas.